I'm Nick McKay, co-founder of Veer and dad of three. Thanks for joining me today. I'm excited to share some pretty big product news here at Veer. This gives me the privilege of representing a small but incredibly talented group of designers and engineers who have been obsessing nonstop for over three years on what I'll be sharing here in a minute. We opened with a video from our We Are Not Strollers ad campaign. In truth, We Are Not Strollers is more than just a slogan to us. We're an active group and it's how we live our personal lives and how we think about product at Veer. It's a mindset that declares that life doesn't have to stop when we have kids. Adventures can continue and will become even richer. We can embrace the activities we've always loved and celebrate their profoundly greater purpose. Even more than that, we get that phones, tablets, and now even the metaverse are part of our new normal. But we believe the earth itself provides us a blank canvas for experiences that can teach our kids even more in tactile ways that shape who they become. We sort of think of the earth as our touchscreen we use to raise the wild in our child. The idea for our first product, the all-terrain cruiser, came from our team's inability to traverse up and down hills with a conventional stroller. Pushing up a hill or through loose or rough terrain can be a challenge, but pulling is much easier. The cruiser was born from that single insight. It's been an incredible privilege to see how families explore with the cruiser. You inspire us, and we believe there are more adventures to be had. We also know that some of those will push the limits of what current products can do. For the past three years, we've been working on the next big thing for Veer, something that would push boundaries even further and make getting outside together even more accessible. Today, on behalf of a very passionate and somewhat exhausted team, I'm proud to say that we are announcing six new outdoor adventure products for our families. A first of its kind breakthrough child booster seat, an all-terrain stroller, an all-terrain double stroller, an ultra-terrain jogger, a child bike seat, and a trail and camp chair. So, a Veer booster seat, a Veer stroller and double stroller, a Veer jogger, a Veer bike seat, and a Veer camp chair. Except, it's not six products. It's one thing that was inspired by all you do as a family created to seamlessly transition from adventure to adventure. We call it switchback. Think about it as one seat with multiple personalities. Before we go deep, join me for a quick walk down memory lane. Back in the day, traveling with infants was simpler, but a lot less safe. There was a lot of this, and this too. In the 70s, when people started giving serious thought to the matter, they came up with some daring ideas. However, these safety seats kept the child in one place only, inside the car. Some 20 years later, the next big idea came when an engineer designed a permanent base for the infant car seat to lock into, making it easy to take the seat out of the car. Not long thereafter, that car seat sat right into a stroller seat, creating the stroller travel system for the first time. Then, at the turn of the century, the fabric stroller seat became reversible and removable, so those car seats could click right in. And lightweight travel system stroller frames with incredible compact folds were born. Although these innovations are dominant today, it's been 20 years, and we wonder if we may soon look back and think, gee, that was old school. It's kind of fun and maybe a bit frightening to see some of that. As our team thought about the modern travel system, we had some insights. First, the ability to take your infant car seat onto a stroller frame is liberating, but that's really only helpful for a few months until infants can sit safely in a stroller seat but then they're confined to a fabric stroller seat with limited functionality for years. Why? Why hasn't someone thought about the center of the ecosystem being a great seat that's not limited by all the regulatory constraints of an infant car seat? Then an active outdoor family wants to be active outdoors on all sorts of terrain. Yet strollers today are mainly designed for strolling on pavement. What would happen if we designed a legit system from the ground up for all terrain? 
And finally, we like variety. We might want to jog, bike, stroll, camp out, whatever. And those desires may change over time. Why isn't there one system designed to let us do it all? The average family will own over four strollers. That's a pretty full garage. Does it have to be that way? So all of this brings us here today. Everything you'll see is made possible by the revolutionary switchback seat. It's the first structured, multi-purpose child seat that goes where active parents want to go. With switchback, we don't have to be held hostage by a cobbled together mix of products that don't work well with each other. The switchback seat is sort of how Herman Miller might design a kid's seat. It's a new breed of stroller seat. Use it by itself as a booster in a restaurant or take it for a ride. Then attach it to our four-wheel all-terrain stroller frame or our three-wheel ultra-terrain jogger frame. Then move it to your bike with our bike mount. Then it can even elevate its height to the perfect level for campsites, sidelines, trails, and more with a camp and trail adapter. And it even fits on the cruiser to provide recline. All of this was designed by the same team that developed Cruiser, led by my co-founder, Andrew Bowman. Who better to take you through the details than him? Andrew? Thanks, Nick. Switchback is the industry's first structured seat. That enables us to do some special things with it, starting with giving it incredible shock absorption characteristics. Most strollers have a shock or two. The switchback system has four, including two in the seat itself. Novel seatback isolation dampeners with up to 10 millimeters of deflection and an energy absorbing exoskeleton seat bottom and back, each with up to another 10 millimeters of deflection. These two features work in symphony to subtly absorb the rough and tumble of various terrain and reduce the force of impact by up to 30%. Additionally, we have provided a unique three position calf support that is designed to provide great support no matter how the seat is positioned. To increase flexibility between products, we developed a simple and ergonomic push button connect and release mechanism to easily attach and remove switchback. Then we designed all of our frames and adapters to fit the exact dimensions of switchback so interchangeability is optimized. The switchback seat itself does a lot, but the frames and adapters that make up the system have also been carefully considered, precisely engineered to deliver on the inspiration behind this system. Both our hand roll and our hand jog frames have two additional shock absorption features that complete the suspension story. We added robust front wheel suspension and a patented tunable shock absorber that you can dial down for an infant or dial up as your child grows. Or it can be adjusted for various types of terrain with a simple turn of a beautiful machined aluminum dial adjuster. Additionally, we increase the size of the front and rear wheels by 25 millimeters each over the industry norm for improved maneuverability on smooth and more vitally on rougher terrain without sacrificing nimbleness. With and roll, we're proud to have overcome some obstinate challenges so that when you convert it into a double stroller with our second seat adapter, the second seat is a legit switchback seat, not some junior version of a fabric seat. Additionally, there are many ways today's parents enjoy spending time with their kids. This includes family bike rides, as well as some relaxing time at the other end of the journey. For this, we created an adapter to quickly turn switchback into a bike seat using the exact same connection interface as with the stroller and the jogger. We also created a compact chair adapter that can collapse and fit into the storage basket to turn switchback into a child-centric seat while enjoying some rest time. Again, using the exact same connection interface as with the stroller, jogger, and bike adapter. Built into the switchback seat is a new to world feeding booster mode with bottom and back seat straps to securely elevate the seating surface to table height for mealtime while out on a full day's adventures. These integrated straps are always there, conveniently hidden under the footrests when not needed. We also saw that many of today's strollers are seemingly focused on being beautiful works of art instead of being legit outdoor gear that can get dirty or muddy without fear of a full day of cleaning afterwards. That's a huge disincentive to fully enjoying family adventures. To solve cleanability, we designed a comfortable substructure to be used without a seat insert for ultimate hose washability. But to take comfort up a level, our various inserts can just pop in and then out for easy hose or machine washing. 
This easy removability is only made possible because of the structured nature of the switchback. Another novel aspect of switchback is the ability to customize by color, age, season, and adventure type. Color tastes might shift from time to time, or maybe you just want to add a bright color for the spring or a darker color when the leaves start turning. How do we solve that? Well, it turns out we already have with Cruiser. Simple, easy color change outs that refresh the look, just like you might change a watch band. Plush, cozy, warm soft goods in the winter, cool, breathable, performance soft goods in the summer. This makes for a striking modern child mobility system, iconic in much the same way as Cruiser. Other seat inserts do even more. For example, our ultra soft and easily washable infant insert accommodates kids from birth on. And our shearling insert and winter muff make adventures in colder months much more fun. When design teams become so focused on delivering high levels of innovation, sometimes they can forget about the little things that consumers expect and want. We didn't lose sight of that. Switch and roll and switch and jog are loaded with these core features. For the switchback seat, this includes one hand recline, one click removability and reversibility with both seat one and seat two, plus soft goods, five point safety harnesses, and an extra coverage canopy. For switch and roll, this includes a large storage basket, a height adjustable handle, and the ability to accept one or two infant car seats facing in either direction. For the switch and jog, this includes the same features as switch and roll, along with a deceleration brake, wider foam filled, never flat rubber tires designed specifically for more off-road applications, and functionality for the seat to face in either direction. And for both, this includes the industry's leading fold mechanism, executed with veer precision, making it quick and simple to store with or without the switchback seat attached. We took the same approach with switchback on material selection as we did with Cruiser. Anodized aluminum, cast aluminum, and textured perforated plastics seamlessly work together to optimize for weight, performance, and fit and finish. With that, let me turn it back over to Nick. Thanks, Andrew. Rest assured, as you'd expect from Veer, safety is just a non-negotiable. The good news is that the switchback system meets or exceeds exacting safety standards for strollers, joggers, bike seats, feeding boosters, and bassinets. It is JPMA safety certified in every category it can be. The bad news is it wasn't easy, as you might imagine, with so many components that needed to work seamlessly together. But we did it, and we know it's going to take others a long time to catch up. Okay, let's talk about pricing and availability. The breakthrough switchback seat is $399. The end roll and the end jog frame are $499 each. The end bike adapter is $129, and the end chill adapter is $99. Pre-orders begin today for most items, and shipments begin in July and August for some, and later this fall for others. Then, infant car seat adapters are $49 each. Color kits range from $99 to $129 and include both the seat pad and a canopy. And our trail rated bassinet adds $199. The great news with Switchback is that you can add components over time, as you need them. There's no need to buy it all now. A host of other accessories are available as well, ranging from $24 to $149. And as with Cruiser, Veer will continue to invent new accessories that will add purpose to the switchback system for years to come. Well, that's all for now. Thank you for joining us. I'd like to leave you with a short ad from our switchback campaign. Have a great day.